Hey, this is Paroxide, and this is Blood Death Knight Guide for Gorfin. In Phase 1, he does an ability called Shadow of Death. He targets random players, so if you get targeted by this debuff, you will die and get sent into his stomach. After that happens, you get another debuff, which is called Gorfin's Corruption, and if you die with this debuff, you will die for real and you will need to be combatrized. So make sure you don't die. Inside Gorfin's stomach, you need to pick up the ad called Enraged Spirit. It has an ability called Blowing Shout. Make sure you interrupt it, otherwise the spirit will gain 300% increased physical damage for 10 seconds. In case you messed up, instantly use your Eyes One Fortitude and call for external cooldowns. He also does an ability called Fell Fury, which inflicts far damage so you can negate it with Anti-Magic Shell. And continue to stand in it while your Anti-Magic Shell is active for 3 runic bar. In case your anti-magic shell is on cooldown, make sure you dodge it. At 70% health, the Gorbon spirit will perform ability called Slam and run out of Gorfin's stomach. Instantly follow the spirit. If you're doing this fight on mythic difficulty, announce to DPS that they need to DPS your spirit down. Also announce that the spirit ran out so it gets picked up by the other tank. When the Gorgon spirit is outside, make sure you take turns with the other tank because the spirit applies a debuff called Fell Flames, which inflicts far damage, this ability stacks, and uh, make sure you keep performing the tank switch. Preferably, you want to switch on 3 stacks. If you're tanking Gorfin at the same time as you are tanking the Ad, make sure you call for external cooldowns, or use your Icebone Fortitude or Runtap. Also decide with the other tank who's going to interrupt first because of Belowing Shot, so you don't both interrupt at the same time. When Gorfin reaches zero energy, he begins a Feast of Souls, and that's when the Phase 2 begins. During this phase, unstable souls will spawn from the back of the room, so make sure you soak them as a tank, unless you're doing this fight on Mythic difficulty. If you are, let your raid members clear their Gorfin's Corruption debuff. I recommend you get shield blames for this fight since you can slow spirits just by blood boiling. Also, don't forget to grip the ads while you're in stomach. If this guide helped you out, make sure you like, comment and subscribe, it helps me out a lot. If you wanna ask anything, feel free to do so. If you wanna check guides for any of the other bosses, just click the annotations. I'll see you in the next video and thanks for watching.